Though she spends much of her retirement traveling the world, Emily Shornstein still finds time to help with medical research. Emily is a retired nurse who volunteers for studies involving Alzheimer's disease, which can sometimes call for some very invasive procedures. Yeah, I've done MRIs and CAT scans, uh, and even an LP, lumbar puncture. But now she's testing a new approach. This one simply involves a pen, paper, and a few minutes of her time. It's called a SAGE test, and a new study shows it can reveal volumes about a patient's mind. What we found was that um, this SAGE self-administered test correlated very well with the very detailed cognitive testing. Dr. Douglas Shari and his team at the Ohio State University Wexner Medical Center developed the test. They gave it to more than a thousand patients over five years and found that nearly 30 percent showed early signs of cognitive problems they didn't know they had. By repeating the test from time to time, doctors now have a cheap and easy way to monitor their patients and detect even slight changes in their cognitive ability. If we see this change, we can catch it really early and we can start treatments much earlier than we did without a test. Which is crucial. Studies show most Alzheimer's patients wait three to four years before being treated. That's not likely to happen to Emily. In all her travels, she's collected elephants from all over the world, which is only fitting for someone committed to helping preserve memory by taking part in studies like these. It's a way to maybe help me or help somebody else in the future. At Ohio State's Wexner Medical Center, this is Clark Powell reporting.